in this fourth lesson about deism, we will talk to a deist again and address him. Now we ask the deist, does the creator you believe in have wisdom? Or does he do things just for fun? The being that created this realm so beautifully and attached so many uses to things definitely has wisdom, for only a wise being can create things with such wisdom. Everything in this world has a duty. Everything is equipped with some uses. Nothing is wasted. There is nothing useless. This proves that our Creator has wisdom. You probably accept that our Creator has wisdom. If you deny it, all beings will stand against you and deny by showing the wisdom within them. Let us think about you a bit. You have been given eyes that notice all of the degrees of beauty. However, the eyes given to animals see this realm only in black and white. You have been given a tongue that measures and understands the taste of all food items. However, the tongue given to animals perceives only a few tastes. You have been given a mind that virtually becomes a key and opens all locks. You have been given feelings and organs like eyes, tongue, and mind. They have not been given to animals. We mentioned all of them in order to ask you the following question. Since our Creator has wisdom, He definitely will not waste and do useless things. Why did our wise Creator do so many things and give us so many valuable organs? Why did He not give us eyes that see only in black and white? Why did He not give us a tongue that perceives only a few tastes? Why did He give us the mind that perceives the finest arts? Why did He place love, which encompasses everything, within our hearts? What is the reason for them? Do not say, He did them randomly, without a purpose. For we determined at the beginning that the Creator of this realm had wisdom. Now you say, this Creator, who has wisdom, gave us those valuable organs randomly. He wasted. He has no purpose. If He created them without a purpose, it means He has no wisdom. If He has wisdom, it means He did not create them without a purpose. He has wisdom. Know the following very well. That being that created you, like an antique art, and that gave you those organs and feelings definitely did so for a purpose. The mind cannot discover those purposes on its own. Those purposes can be taught to us only through prophets that receive revelation. Not to accept prophets means to accept that those organs and feelings were given to us in vain and that our Creator wasted. This means our Creator has no wisdom, which is wrong according to the witnessing of all beings. Since it is wrong, prophets and books were definitely sent and we were taught about those purposes. We believe and confirm it.